Hey everyone, today in this video, I'm gonna show you how to set up and connect your iRobot BravaJet M6 Robot Mop with the iRobot app that's available for iOS and Android devices. If you're interested in the M6 or you wanna find out more about it, the link to it will be in the video description. Let's go ahead, let's get this set up. So we have the M6 plugged in and charging. We also have the iRobot app downloaded on our mobile device. Now keep in mind, once you have it downloaded, you will need to sign in or create an account with iRobot. Once you do, you'll be at this page where you can view all of your devices. So in our case, we have quite a few Roombas already set up here. So to add a new device, we need to select the menu button in the top left hand corner, choose add your product, and it's gonna start searching for nearby devices if you give it location permissions. In our case, this did not show up, but we could scan a QR code if we had one, or we can just manually select the product. That's what we're gonna do here. And now we can browse, is it a, a vacuum? Is it a vacuum and mop or just a mopping robot? In our case, it's just a mopping robot. So we're gonna select the M series here. And we have a checklist that we need to make sure we have all set and ready to go. They show you how to get the charging base installed. We have our Wi-Fi information. Make sure you're connected to your Wi-Fi network, then select yes, continue enter your password. Now we need to activate the BravaJet. So we need to press the spot and home button for around two seconds. And we should hear a sound. All right, there we go. Press the buttons, continue. It's gonna search for our mop. All right, now it's connecting to the Wi-Fi, verifying the password, then it will establish the cloud connection. All right, password's been verified. We had a little chime there. We also had Another sound and chime. There we go. Everything was successfully connected. Your robot is fully set up and ready to go. Vo it's clean to get to work. We got a voice prompt there too. Select continue. We can name it if we want. Let's do BravaJet. This is the six, was it zero, one, two. Select done. Setup's complete. We have a nice slide to go through, giving us the basics of what our mop can do. We'll just quickly click through these animations, but it's really cool. Dry sweeping and wet mopping, two different options for you. Showing you the row by row clean, detects carpets and rugs. Smart enough to return home, charge and pick up where it left off. It's really smart, great slides. Specific room clean if you want. You get the idea here. Make sure you prep your home and here we go. We're taking in there. First thing it wants to do is start a mapping run. You can do that now or later. We're gonna do it later. And you'll see here, we're now in the device settings where we need to refill the tank. We have that prompt here. It's unable to start because of that. Here's our map settings, this little map icon. That's where we can start our new mapping run. Favorite section where you want it to clean. Do you want to set up and build a schedule for it? You can create that right here. Which day is of the week? What time? Do not disturb settings. Cleaning history. Once we have a cleaning history, that'll populate there. Um, device messages. And we can view our product settings so we can learn more about our particular model here. We can locate it. If it ever gets lost, it'll play a sound for us. We can adjust our cleaning preferences. So how do you want this to clean with its mop path? A little bit of overlap, more overlap, or a lot. Try it on the more setting and see if you need it more or less from there. I prefer having it overlap more than less. And then what liquid amount do you want to use? So eco standard or ultra, that'll depend obviously how dirty your floors out or how often you want to clean that sort of thing, but you can adjust the liquid amount there. Our language, we can reboot it, Wi-Fi settings and change Wi-Fi if needed. And then further down the iRobot store help section and iRobots beta. So that's it. Simple, straightforward. Now it's time to fill up the tank and start cleaning.